So, that Siri person, they teleported somehow. It was more specific than just teleporting though. That's a lot here. Okay then. How about I go have a chat with him then? Not a very decorated entrance, but makes sense. Doubt he would go above ground that much. Hello. Hello there. Why why are you in my home? Two reasons, really. And, and what might those be? Oh, uh, the first is, I'm aware that you're participating in the revolution, but I don't think I'm aware why. I like to do whatever causes the most chaos, and a revolution sounds like a lot of fun to me. Oh, so you simply want to cause chaos. There's no ideological aspect for it. Yeah, um, ideologies aren't that big where I'm from. It's just whatever is the most fun. There really aren't any rules. Yeah. Right, okay. So what, what do you find fun about the chaos? Is it wanton destruction? Is it human suffering, or is it just the general disorder? When there's chaos, I can do whatever I want. And I like to be able to follow my own agenda and not be governed. Right, so... A human death is just an added plus. Good to know. Well... I think I can offer you something. And what is that? How about if you, say, help me when the revolution uprises, stab a few people in the back, cause a little chaos that way? <laughs> yes. Then if the revolution falls from your chaos, I will bring you to a land where there are no governments, and I will not, my government will not affect you. Now, that sounds like a fun idea. It does. No rules? None at all? Well, there would be no killing me, but apart from that... I could have all of the underground? Oh, yeah, the underground is perfectly yours to take. My own entire underground. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. You said there were two reasons? Ah, yes. The second one was... Your magic. What are you referring to? I just know what I would call a party trick. <laughs> helps me get around. I suppose it would. So, do you go between the next eye, or is it to a central location? I like to say I know the underground very well. Whenever I jump to where I need to go, I can always find my way home. Is that clear enough, or will I have to spell it out? No, no, I understand. Also, you can put the weapon away by now. If I was, if I was going to attack you, I would have by now. I suppose that's true. What's your obsession with my ability? I like to keep tabs on people with magic. Why is that? I'm not hurting anyone. Yeah, if I had eyebrows, they would be heavily raised. 
but <laughs> quite frankly, I don't particularly care if you're using them to hurt anyone. It's just if you're, call it paranoia, but people with magic are usually the only actual threats. I like to know where they are and where they stand in the overall hierarchy. Do you know any That's other true. party tricks? That's just the one for now, but I love to learn. Seem to have some hot feet there. Can you survive fire or something? I used to be able to. And then I was forced from my home and had most of my abilities stripped from me. Uh, it is so important to you. What kind was your home? Because as far as I'm aware, you're from a different hell to the one present here. Yeah. Um. Whatever you guys call the nether, I think that's what it's called. It's the closest equivalent. It's I, where I'm from is a lot more layered. After it's more of an afterlife. That right. Only very powerful people can get to while they're still alive. I see. Is it one of those nine layer models? That's correct. Hmm. Interesting. If I do help you, as you seem to want me to, could I maybe get some of um lessons from you out of it? That would entirely depend on what you wish me to teach you. It's come... I believe it's fairly known that you can do magic. I mean, I don't exactly fight it. So, I haven't been able to do much magic for a long time, and I'd like to get it back in my hands. What would you like? The constructs? The enchantments? The barriers, the wards. Being that I love chaos, anything offensive at your disposal? Hmm. We don't have to cover logistics now, but basically, per request, if I want something and I know you know it and I help you, can I also know what you know? I will grant knowledge in exchange for works. Oh, then it appears to me that we have a deal. Good. Now then, let us organize how to bring some chaos. Yes, who are your top priorities? Currently, this lemon grass is... An ideological problem. She and her... My wonderful neighbor? Yes, her... She and herself is not... A physical threat, but... She motivates others. I see. I can... Throw a wrench in her plans as they come. Good. And when the time comes... Words won't be the only thing that will be sharp and against her. A crass metaphor, but a fitting one. Yeah, linguistics are not my forte. Okay. You're not exactly here to spin words of weaving. Correct. I'm here to do whatever helps me, and it appears that what helps me helps you right now. For well, now, I imagine if there comes a time where it doesn't, we can part ways without immediate bloodshed, but 
you know. Yes, I would hope so. Mr. President. <laughs> I hope so too. Do you have a title? Or is it just Siri? Are you asking for my full name? I believe so. Well, my first name is Cyrus, but I go by Siri because it rolls off the tongue a bit better. My last name, on the other hand, is a bit harder to say in your language, but I believe that Grimax Grimax? Mal Malgrimax was my father. J. Malgrimax is my last name. You don't have a great naming system in hell. It's not the entire point that it kind of sucks for everyone. It yeah. feels like the point of hell it is in a lot of places. I quite liked it. Mm. But what I thought didn't align with what they thought, and now I'm here. Everyone becomes a stranger at some point. The same, really. I've been a stranger for so long. Nice to have a friend every once in a while. That's very true. Are you saying that we are friends? I am saying we could be, given time. I feel like one meeting is not enough, but... Well, the first time we met, I was trying to kill one of your current targets, if that's correct? You were trying to kill an Adrian, correct? Yes, that's right. I think that's his name. He is... a complex situation. It's very delicate, and I would rather deal with him personally. Understood. Your wish is my command. I'll stay out of it with him. Yes. Is what I'm saying. Yes, and... Unfortunately, that does include... the physical aspects of Malachi. Yeah, I think I met him. I imagine you did. It's not a hard man to miss. I believe I will bid you adieu for now. Yes. It will be a pleasure working with you, Creeper. As will you, Cyrus. <laughs>